from your own perspective, a series of jumps, how were they for you? Yeah, um, the jumps, the jumps themselves, all of them felt good. Obviously, some of them weren't on the board, um, but it was expected because I added an extra two steps onto my run-up, and it's the first time I've done that in competition since 2015. So um, I am very happy with the distance. I was going to say, did you expect to go that far? Um, after my first jump, I, I no, coming into the competition now, um, but after my first jump, I was like, okay, <laughs> even though it was a no jump, um, I was happy with the distance. It felt easy, and it went a long way. So um, after that, yeah give me a lot of confidence. Is, is the best thing you take from this is that the competition went and you were able to respond? Is that a good thing? It is definitely a good thing because um, I think I've lost that in the last couple of years. Um, I feel like I used to be a really good competitor um, when I was younger but I'm glad I was able to respond for sure because the no jumps were a little bit disappointing because I felt like they went a long way. So um, in my last jump um, it's funny because one of my, tra my, my training partner, Kevin, he always says that he's like a, a third round specialist. And obviously we had six jumps here, but um, I just thought of him and what he always does in the last round. And yeah, it's, it's sort of, you know, never really, um, yeah, just like don't settle on, on one jump because it was good and I was happy I was able to pull out the six round big jump. Back next week? Yeah, back next week. I'll be... We'll talk more of it. Okay. <laughs> okay. See you soon.